The Shallows is about a young woman who is on a journey, and she is, uh, she's a surfer, and she's going to a beach that her mother told her about. And we discover in the story that her mother has actually died, and that that has caused her uh, some emotional turmoil. But she's going to this beach, and it's a very, very unique beach. She's going to surf that beach. And she gets to the beach, and uh, she goes for a surf. She meets some local guys. Seems to be having a pretty good time, right? Yeah. I mean, and she gets attacked. And it's, you know, this is a secret beach. And uh, for her, it's almost like the place where she can be closest to her mother. Nancy, as a character, is a, she's a medical student when we meet her, but she's just dropped out of medical school because she's really questioning what she's doing with her life. Her mother has died of cancer, and she, as a medical student, was unable to help her, which I think uh, was a very uh, complicated decision for her. Um, she's an interesting character at a crossroads. Blake was always the right choice. Uh, she is obviously beautiful. She had an inner strength. We discovered, I think, on the on on location that she is physically just very tough, and she was really up for yeah. the adventure. I think Blake is very likable. Blake is very tough, very smart, very resourceful. Those are things that we want to portray in in Nancy, but yet with like everybody else, you know, there are insecurities. And, and I think that, um, you know, Blake wasn't shy about, about, you know, bringing those to the forefront so her character could grow. I mean, Matty and I were on a mission to find the best beach in the world. I mean, literally, we went to Australia and we were driven around, we were taking hel helicopters all up and down the coast and were shown wonderful places. And each time, Matty and I would look at each other and be like, it's not good enough. It's not special enough. It doesn't have that wow factor that I want to have this character arrive at this beach, look at it, and the audience have the same feeling that she has. You know, because for her it has an emotional feeling, but for the audience it's the first time that they're seeing it, but it has to feel special, it has to feel like mystical. Everything's protected there. It is a World Heritage Site, so we have to be very conscious of that the entire time. Uh, there are no water bottles. There, you know, we have to take care of our garbage in a very specific way, but we barged in an entire movie company yeah. on two huge barges and basically made this movie. And it was really, I want to just say, a testament to Jama's vision because he, and he once said this to me when we were looking for the beach. He said, you know, people are paying 10 or $15 to come to see our movie in a movie theater. Let's give them something they've never seen before. And in fact, no one's ever seen that beach before in a movie because right. it's never been shot. Yeah. Um, and uh, I think it was, uh, it was not a gamble because we knew that it was special, but we, didn't knew, we, we had to accept the consequences of, of having a very limited time, very limited number of people that we could bring, limited resources because we're far away, and and the weather and all of that, and we just took those challenges and said four frames of this beach are worth more than two hours of another beach that is not perfect. For me, this film is really about facing the ultimate fear, and I think that, that it's manifested in the shark. I think most people, if they were in the water and had to face an attack by a great white shark, uh, can't even imagine that kind of fear. But seeing that and going with Nancy on the journey to conquer her fear, not only of the shark, but really the fear, her emotional fears, and the death of her mother and, and kind of breaking through that, uh, it's an incredibly powerful story. I think people are going to be surprised that it's also an emotional movie. I think... Um, it's very intense, and um, all of all I want to do in my movies is to make sure that people get their money's worth. 
of the experience, you know, and it's a movie, you know, as we've seen in the little test screenings that we've done where people really, some people are watching the movie and they're swimming with her, you know, it has a, it really has a it's visceral, visceral yeah. a visceral thing that, and, you know, uh, it's really, I think, is a great movie to watch collectively, you know, um, in the big screen.